Milton! Milton, are you gonna be a good boy? Are you gonna sit? Sit for mom. Okay, no, yep. See what Maddie's doing? Be oh, okay. Milton. Milton. Mm. Oh, Dee Dee's over there being a spoiled boy. Mm-hmm. That is your dog right there. No. You're massaging his back? He gets a back massage? Uh oh. Milton wants in on the action. Milton! Milton! Milton, sit! Milton, sit! Milton, sit! 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 Lord Jesus! Milton! Sit! Sit! Milton! Oh, good boy! Why are you not a good boy? Oh, but, oh, you're such a good boy when you look at me like that. Oh, jeez. Good morning, guys. Happy 2021. It is so good to see you. I hope you had a great new year. I hope you're having a great new year so far. I'm about to have an even greater new year. You know why? Because now it is time for the Zip Fish Shake. And today we are having, bam, oh, peach mango. I mean, already, the best year ever. Come on now. Honestly, you guys, I can't tell you the last time I had a Zip Fizz. Like, this is gonna be a great day already, I can tell. Shout out to the homies Chris and Miriam over at Keto Chow. Don't forget, you can get 10% off your Keto Chow purchase by using the link in the description box below. I absolutely am obsessed with their sugar bottle. All right, guys, let's get ready to shake it in three, two, one. Shake it for the new year. Uh. To reaching our goals, to staying on our path, to challenging ourselves, and believing that we can do whatever we set our mind to. Mm, amen. Mm. Ooh. Oh. The peach mango. Oh, it's so refreshing and tart. Mmm. Mm, tropical, if you will. Mm. Okay, guys, well, I am participating in 75 hard right now. It's like day five for me. So I'm about to weight lift, but that's gonna be only one of the two 45 minute workouts that I have to do today. So you'll see everything I'm doing to complete 75 hard. You'll also see what I'm eating. Spoiler alert, taco tray. Mm. But let's get to exercising. Oh, I missed you. with cello wisps they are my absolute favorite i get these at costco i have parmesan i have cheddar cheese they look like this they're just little basically cheese quarters that are just dried out cheese i love them because they are low carb they're crunchy they're salty they're delicious and i'm not really a breakfast person so i kind of like to start off my day with a snack so i don't really have a lot of food or anything too heavy first thing in the morning so i'm gonna have these mmm mmm Ooh, I've already started on the gallon of water that I have to have for 75 hard. That zip fizz that I had earlier did not count. For 75 hard, it has to be straight up water, and that's what I'm having. I honestly haven't had a problem with this at all. So, like, it's just amazing what you can do when you, like, challenge yourself and be intentional about setting a goal. Like, if I wasn't thinking about it, I'd only drink, like, 20 to 30 ounces of water a day. Like, because I just go through my whole day not thinking about drinking water. But now that I'm forcing myself or intentionally trying to get a gallon in every day, like, it's no sweat. Okay, guys, so another one of the requirements for 75 hard is not only do you have to do two 45-minute workouts a day, but one of those workouts has to be outside, right? So, it is January in Kentucky, but I am outside. I have brought my exercise bike outside you guys this is by far like the best purchase i made in 2020 like and i got it like in december 
So this little bike was like $130 on Amazon. I have it linked in my Amazon store. So if you go to the description of this video, uh, my Amazon store has like a fitness section. This bike is in there. I am absolutely obsessed with it. So I'm just gonna hop on my bike, do 45 minutes of bike riding while I look at the beautiful terrain of my backyard. Uh, and then it'll be time to eat. Like though, that's what I'm really excited about, right? So it's time to exercise. Okay guys, now's the time. I'm so excited. This is just my standard taco bowl. I have lettuce, I have cheese, I have sour cream, I have ground beef, I have some of my homemade chipotle mayo, I have some pork rinds, I have some guacamole, Quest chips, like, oh my God. And then of course, Taco Bell fire sauce and Tapatio on here, like, oh, oh my goodness, I can't even. It's the textures and the temperatures, you guys. It's the cold crunchiness of the lettuce with the warm meatiness of the ground beef. Come on now, you can't tell me nothing. Man. I could literally eat this every day. I also do plan to eat this every day. Like, oh my God, it is so great. Okay, well, I'm off to eat this and drink some water because I still got a lot to go before my gallon is done. Okay guys, I'm finishing up my day with two Quest Bars. Yes, you heard me right, two. These are in my macros because I designed them that way, okay? Like, this is my first week back to keto post the Christmas holiday and like, I knew I needed to ease in slowly and I knew I was gonna need my sweets. So I built in two Quest Bars to my macros. I won't keep eating like this moving forward, but like, I'm not gonna lie, I've been enjoying this. These are delicious. I love Quest Bars. This is s'mores, this is peanut butter brownie smash and like, hashtag no regrets. After this, my eating window will officially be closed and all I have left is to drink a butt ton of water. Yes. Gallon done and I'm excited. I think this is the earliest I've finished yet. It's like 5.45 and I am done. <laughs> that gives me a relatively good shot of sleeping through the night, right? So it's been tough having to get in this gallon of water because I've been up going to the bathroom multiple times a night. But it's getting better. Of course, I find that the earlier I finish the gallon in the day, the better chance I have of getting some good sleep. So 545 is awesome. Like drinking the gallon is not the problem. It's remembering to drink the gallon that's the problem. Like that's why I normally have it sitting right here with me or as soon as my cup is empty, I immediately go fill it back up again. Like it's not the amount of water, it's just actually remembering to do it. So that's pretty dope. I am glad I drank it and I'm feeling satisfied. I'll tell you this, I have not had one soda at all this year <laughs> because when you drink a gallon of water a day, you don't want any more liquid. <laughs> like, <laughs> I had a zip fizz this morning, that's only because I was working out, but like, I don't want, I don't want any more water. I don't want any more anything for the rest of the day. I just kind of want to coast. And so that's what I'm gonna do. I am watching some training videos online. I'm having a really good day, and I think this will be it for me. I am super glad. Hi, Diddy. Hi, Diddy. You being a good boy? <laughs> you being a good boy? Yes, you are. I just, you have not been on the vlog all day today, and I just have to show everyone my beautiful oh. husband. Everyone, if you don't know, this is Richard. We's married. Uh huh. So, how was your day today, honey buns? It was really fun. It was really fun. That's good. My day was really fun as well. What did you eat for dinner? Looks like a salad. Mm. Salad with bits of ham. <laughs> salad with bits of ham. That's actually quite keto. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So okay. I had a great uh, day today. It was fun. 
<laughs> Thanks so much for joining us for this full day of eating, and we'll see you next week. Yay. Bye. Bye. Diddy. Diddy buds. What is you did? What are you doing, Diddy? Oh, oh, ow. Oh. Right by Diddy. Okay. Where are you going, Bubs? Where are you going? Okay, bye bye. <laughs> bye bye, Diddy. I forget everything. I forget everything. Oh, look at you. Okay. Okay, we're done.